Hey, welcome. So, I fucked up. I know I said I would record and play The Shore. I did. I did do that. However, as I was fixing my sound issues, I recorded it at 60 FPS. So not only did I record it badly, so it was all chopped up, but I lost part of the videos as well. The audio is there, and it sounds great, but I'm going to have to re-record it. So, in between then, I figured I'd give myself a little bit of uh, a reprieve from it to get myself back in there, forget a little bit, because it was a fantastic game, and I'm definitely going to want to play that again and show you guys just how amazing it is. So, for now, I am going to give you Song of Horror. Now, of course, there is also a, uh, let's see if I went into settings here, there is a Lovecraft setting, however, that is the hardest, and I honestly, I, I haven't played this game before, hopefully, uh, if the recording goes well, I haven't played this before, so, let's just jump right in and see what we got going on. I think this was a good pick. If he knows about it, why doesn't he get rid of it? I do have headphones, and I do have a gamepad. I'm gonna keep the keyboard, though. Just for the time being. Oh, I'm so angry! Old aesthetic, though. I like it. Man, I know those feels. Home sweet home. Oh, I'm moving the head. All right. All right. Let's see what we got. A flashlight. Uh, let's see, my old flashlight. It saved me more than once in the great outdoors. Well, it's probably gonna save you and- I'm not gonna turn off the light. I don't know what you want from me. People must bring back some really good memories. I can't see them. So I- I would hope so. Alright. Whew, this is gonna be... This is gonna be a game. What do we got? Oh! Yeah, right, yeah, right, yeah, right. My 80s vinyl collection. Oh. Oh, no. 19, yeah, yeah, you know. Some point. Maybe next month I'll be able to afford a shelf to put them on. You know, I'm seeing a few shelves over there. You could build it yourself. I've built many things. Let's see. Oh. Oh, you're not going to actually talk. All right. Uh, it's actually a nice afternoon. The kind my boss likes to fuck up with one of his stupid errands. What do I do for a job? Sophie, it's taken me many years to put those pictures out again. Mom? Wife? Passed with random stuff. My apartment is definitely too small. I know those feels. Someday, right? Mm. Sebastian P. Husher, the historical film actor. 
He sold 40 million copies of his last novel. Cool. What? Is that just the reflection? Or is, okay, good. I thought there was like some sort of nice uh, uh, snow. You know, the snowflakes on the old the little TVs. Yeah, that's what I figured that was. Static. This is your room. Well, all right. Gonna put the hat on. I got this hat after seeing The Untouchables about 10 years ago. Don't think I've worn it once. Why is it on your bed then? For what you got going on, it would go pretty well with what you, your jacket and things, but nah, I don't know where to put them. I doubt they'd fit on top of the wardrobe. What the? Why do you have so many suitcases? Do you hoard things? I'm in for a fun ironing marathon this weekend. Well, it depends on what job you got going on. Okay. Oh, there it oh, is. Crikey. Seriously? Australia? Hello. Daniel, it's me again. Hey, we've got a bit of a major emergency going on here. Oh, you're joking. Friday evening, and there's an emergency? This is serious business. Sebastian Husher is nowhere to be found, and his manuscript should have been at the office by Tuesday. He won't answer his calls, and he hasn't shown up at his office at the university. He's vanished into thin air. Oh, don't screw with me, Etienne. Call him on Monday or send a courier for him. I, I just got in the door less than five minutes ago. I go myself, but I've got to attend Albert's performance in half an hour. Plus, Husher's house is closer to your place than it is to mine. Come on, man. The sooner you go, the sooner you'll get back home. You're going to owe me a big fat favor. Whatever you want. Write this down. For Abbott Thomas Road. In the old housing developments along Highway EB-15. EB-15? Good God, that's out in the sticks. I plan to take a few days off after this. Well, we'll talk about that once you find him. Oh, and if he gives you the manuscript, don't show it to anyone. And don't go selling it off to the highest bidder. Why well, would you even say that? Do. We'll ring you up when I get back. <laughs> Thanks, Dad. You're saving my skin. Don't sell it. Whatever you do, don't make... A lot Again. of money selling this. Another Friday evening and I'm working as an errand boy. I suppose they're too important over at Wake Publishers to come looking for jolly old Husher themselves. Are you Shit. in publishing? Even I should be too important for that. Though I mustn't overstretch my complaints. Rising from my lot as a drunkard and financial ruin to that of an errand boy is actually quite an improvement. If only things had gone a bit better for the company. Or I'd got on the wagon a bit sooner. Damn, Sophie did the right thing when she divorced me. Uh, I would have divorced myself in her place. Then why'd you put the pictures back up? She's not dead. She left you because Daniel you're a bum. Noya, a bloody alcoholic. Chin up, you. That is Daniel Noya, the bloody ex-alcoholic, after all. There you go. Wake Publishers employee by day, Wake Publishers screwed over lackey by evening. Even Friday evenings. Um. But if I could find Husher, I have a feeling my status at the company would rise quite a bit. After all, he is the publishing firm's biggest star. One can only hope. Let's cross our fingers and hope he's home. Husher Mansion is home to the writer Sebastian P. Husher, his wife, Catherine, their two children, Julia and Sol, and their characters with high speed can move more quickly, but keep in mind they also draw more attention. Do I have stats? It might seem like a good idea to run, but remember, you draw more attention that way. Okay, so walking then and creeping. I wonder if I can crouch.
Hmm. No, that's not great. All right. Tricycle here. Tricycle. I didn't know Hush had kids. Well, we just read it two seconds ago. Got two kids and a wife. Unless they're all gone. Do we need to go through everyone? A newspaper. The murder they arrested about a week ago is on the front page. So why do I need to know that? Well, that's okay. I did. I clicked it. Hello. Is that music? I'd better take a look. You could also turn on the light. All right, light source. Each character has their own light source. I don't care each character. I didn't get to choose a character. Anyways, to turn it off and on, press F. Um, once it's on, you can choose the direction which you want to point it using the mouse. Uh, this will also allow you to illuminate specific areas and also help you interact with objects that may not be right in front of your character. Telekinesis. Perfect. Uh, your light source will never run out. Use it as much as you need. Oh, that's great. That's awesome. Where's my mouse? Oh, I have to hold it. <laughs> I knew that. Is that someone playing a music box? Yeah, right. They look like travel guides. Yeah, I'm probably not going to find anything right off the bat. Um, so let's just go find that music box. Oh, I can kind of move around. No, the music isn't coming from upstairs. Yeah, all right. Here? I thought the door shut on its own. Hold up. Um, so I can't take the mattress yet, so I can't do anything yet until I find that music box. Okay. Easy pleasy. Oh, that's a mirror. Or it should be. Man, that mirror's dirty. I stand by my previous statement. Oh, that's nice static. Can I open up this one? Oh, there's a, wait, 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 there's a letter on that one. Oh, no! Oh god, I'm gonna get lost in this house, just like, just like in Black Mirror. Something on that door. What do you got? Documents and items. Woo! You found an examinable item. Expect it to gain information by pressing E to examine the backside. Use the mouse. Uh, you can access your inventory by pressing I. Perfect. Good. Standard. Uh, a letter from Husher found by Daniel in the, in the author's mansion. Post stamp on August 1st, 1998. Dear Sebastian, how are you? To be completely honest, I must admit that we are all impatiently awaiting your latest work. My dear friend, I must ask a favor of you. Enclosed with this letter, you will find one of the latest items we have purchased at the store. An ornate music box with fascinating engravings. The craftsmanship is astounding, but something else has caught my eye. Or perhaps I should say my ear. The melody, Sebastian, it's particular. You have to listen to it to, for yourself. I had never heard the song before, and my attempts at finding the score, or the name of the composer, composer have failed. I cannot, for the life of me, get that melody out of my head. Ah. Can I read the back side? Okay. Would you be willing to help me find any clues regarding this box and mysterious melody? I would be forever grateful. With warmest wishes, Isaac Farber. P.S. I've also enclosed this little information I managed to find about said box. The letter is addressed to Sebastian. Blum. Blum. Cool. So where's the information about the box? Okay. Interesting. 
Yes. So. What the? How can there be a door there? Um. There's no door there. That's a wall. All right, where's the music? Oh, is the music box coming from inside of that dorm? <sighs> All right, and so it begins. Oh, that's loud. I'd hardly taken a step forward when I heard the door close behind me. When I turned around, the door wasn't there anymore. And all that was Classic. left of it was a strange shadow on the wall. I searched. I despaired. And I screamed until my throat began to burn. The candles started to run out, as did the batteries in my torch. I thought I From had unlimited batteries. Suffocating darkness. The hours went by until turning into days, and I began to fall in and out of a restless sleep. I would hear voices, sometimes right next to me, other times a few yards away. It seemed like they were coming from the other side of the wall. Desperate cries. Howling in horror, mm. and sometimes, the worst of all, a vast, oppressive silence would fall, seeming to emanate from everywhere and nowhere all at once. There was nobody there, just hallucinations, nightmares, black nothingness, and the song from that music box. Did you Trapped cry? in this impossible place, I wondered if I was going to die there. Probably. Three days? Oh, should I really have not have gone in there? Etienne, do you have any news on Daniel yet? Oh, Sophie. No. We've been calling him at home all day, but there's no response. Do you know Ooh. if he's got a mobile phone? No, I, I don't think so. And if he does, he doesn't tend to keep it on him. Oh, man. Is this the publishers? I think I should pass by the Husher place when I leave. Just to see if they know anything. Husher the writer? Your client? Yes, is yeah. the publisher. I sent Daniel over there on Friday, and I haven't heard from him since. What's the address? I'm going to stop by Daniel's place. And if I don't find him, I can go around and ask about him. The house in the outskirts of town, on Highway EB-15. Number four, Abbott Thomas Road. It's a big house. Okay, I'm headed over. Call me if you find him. Uh, of course, same to you. Man, he looked like a P.I. I was excited. But it would make more sense. No, it would make about as much sense. Oh! Now we can pick characters. All right, all right. What do we got? Oh, let's let's go back. Let's actually look at this. Let's see. Life has put Sophie on the test uh, to the test many times, but she always pulls through. It was thanks to this resilience that she summoned the strength to put an end to her failing marriage with Daniel. This is the Sophie. Oh, Sophie who runs a well-known art gallery is now enjoying her ever uh, elusive prosperity. She has always longed for. Okay, yeah, all right. Whenever I light one around me, feels safer and more peaceful. So she has scented candles. What do we got? We have speed, stealth, strength. Serenity. I'm gonna say that's probably along the lines of how much sanity. It's sanity. Oh, uh, let's see. Edney? Is that how they pronounce it? Edney? 
A confident self-made man is sales manager at Wake Publishing. Yep. Making him Daniel's direct supervisor. In his role as, as personal assistant, Daniel has become somewhat of an errand boy, but Ned Nee is slowly giving him greater responsibilities. Although they love to complain about working together, they have grown fond of each other, developing a friendship outside of work that neither of them would like to admit. Fair. And you're also, you got a lighter... Uh, note folder. Writing down anything is important. Secret. Okay, you write down notes. That's not too bad. Is it just as you? Oh, what do we got here? Alexander and his wife Marsha are housekeepers. Oh, the housekeepers. Uh, at Fire Sebastian Hush's mansion, watching over the author's children is one of their many household duties. The Russian couple of Christian faith moved to Europe in the early 80s to attempt to flee from a mysterious past that Alexander rarely ever speaks about. Um, strong. Take a good swig of a flask to soothe the nerves when danger lurks. Always worked for me. Alexander. Fair. Oh, Alina Ramos. Oh, she has a flashlight. Nice. Alina is a passionate, hands-down type of uh, learner. She always eager to get her hands dirty at work, happy and energetic. She has traveled the world with her sister in search of a better life for them both. Now working as electrical technician. Ooh. Uh, Moment security. Alina has put her... Uh, is part of a highly qualified tech support team repairing high-end home security systems for exclusive clients. Whoa, she doesn't work. Uh, she doesn't work very well. It picks up a lot of weird interference. It doesn't. Oh, whatever. So walkie talkie doesn't work, right? Oh, weird interference. That would be kind of cool. And we're back at the beginning. Okay, so we have five, five, four, six. So they all look relatively balanced. Strength and self is pretty high. Oh, but Sandy's way down. Um. Yeah, hard worker. That. Yeah, right. She's really good, but her sanity is really far down. So, I guess it just depends on. How badly I do. <laughs> uh, let's see what else we got. We have. I think I'm. I'll... I'll go with. Um... That sounds pretty good. It's been three days since Daniel entered the Husher Mansion. No one has heard from him since. Pay attention to what characters say. They often give clues about important objects nearby or how to face dangerous situations. Don't forget to use your source of light. Remember, you can use what or where. Uh, you can choose what or where you shine it on and use it to interact with your surroundings. All right. Alright, let's see what exactly we're up against here. Because I have no idea. Good, alright. Always the third person. It might get me later on. I'm gonna run into some walls and just stick on them. The Husher Mashan. One. So it's probably more than one chapter, right? Why is the front door open? Well, you know. Why are you the only one to ask that? Alright, so. Oh, wait, hold up. What is this? Hmm. It's deactivated. Okay. Let's see. Oh, what's this? Is that another newspaper? All right. My dear 
eccentric husband. I left your key on the top drawer of your bureau. I'll go grab that in the library. The children have been very nervous lately. We need to talk about this as soon as you get back. And I don't want them playing with it. They're probably talking about the uh, box. That's fine. My character would not know about that yet. Um, so let's go upstairs and see if we can find that key. I should take a look on this floor first. Oh, is the library not upstairs? Oh god, I don't know. Alright, this is definitely not it. Oh, I don't really want to go right in there. I want to grab that key first. Before we go off and start activating things. Nice little record player. Hey, wasn't Husher's wife a semi-famous chess player? I think he mentioned it one day. Oh, cool, 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 cool. All right. What is that? I see they take their liquor seriously in this house. Oh, I can't see. Ah, oh, maybe I should have gone with the flashlight. Oh, God. Oh, God. Yeah, that's going to be the death of me. I can feel it in my bones. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Fire pit. Well, you can check the fire pit. An opposing beast, just like this house. Man. The fireplace is empty. I could light it if I had some wood. Good to know. Good to know. Let's see if we can find some wood then. We're after a key and wood. Oh, here's the library. All right. So we need to find a bureau in the library. Um, what's this? So this is where Husher did his magic. It all seems so vintage. Is that a bad thing? Oh, come on. All right, here it is. Hold up. I think this is it. Hmm. Dang it, the drawer is stuck. I better oil the sides if I want to get my hands on that key. Oil? These toys remind me of the cartoons my son watches. Uh, I'd ask him to go sign one of these for me. Okay, so we need to find... Now we're in the looking for some oil. Oh, good. A bunch of horror books. Great. The globe must be really old. Another giant globe. I mean... Uh, come on now. So now I need some oil. The best place to find oil would be... What? In the garage, maybe? Oh, God, I don't know. So I need wood, oil. I can't get the key until I get oil. So I got wood and oil. Um, unless there's some... Like, oh, no. That's weird. They said the table, but it seemed like they never actually ate. Got some food here. I don't know if I'll be able to grab any oil until I start up the game. All right. Okay, let's just have a little, quick little look-see, see if we can find something. Teapots, right? Everything's nice and neat, but dusty. I had a housekeeper, apparently. Oh, right, yeah, I'll grab some matches. Ah. Heck yeah. Hmm. Specs, just an ordinary match. Yeah, the there's fine. I'm not gonna use them yet. Oh, I can combine things too. That's pretty cool. All right, kitchen, 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 kitchen. Hmm. What do we got in the kitchen? There's, there's something some... on the counter. Something on the counter. Oh, over there. Oh God. Oh, a laptop. Oh, a ring. Excuse me. What was that? Ring. Okay. Is something. Oh. That's not great. This puddle looks like there's loose wire. Oh, wait. Can I. Alright, can't do anything with that yet. Uh, still eh, covered in dust. Uh, got the ring. Uh, can't try to put some kitchen. Alright, so kitchen. Through the kitchen would be. Uh, Alright. I was going to say the garage, but we got another door here. Maybe that's the basement? Ah. 
All right, what do we got here? Uh, canned goods, healthier stuff than when I was eating when I was young. I mean, that's fair. They're rich. Uh, come on, come on, come on. Oh, wait, hold up. What is this? Okay. Ooh, nice, 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 nice. Ah. Cool. All right, we got oil. Cans of dog food. Whoa, wait a second. Why did I say weird? Cans of dog food, but I haven't seen one anywhere. Oh, that's true. One sec, one more up here. Can I not see that? Or was that just a glint or something? Yeah, it's just a glint or something. Okay. So, we have the oil. We get the key. Perfect. No. No. Here guys, do I walk up to it when you see the listen icon? Press and hold. While you're listening, pay attention to the sound that comes from the other side. Oh! Check out what that noise was. Oh, I hate that. Oh God, that. Nothing. Using your maps. From now on, you can listen to what's happening on the other side of unexamined doors. Sometimes you might have to te have the chance to do it with the other doors. Well, pay attention to the icons when there's anyone. Use the map. Is the map is a mini map? Please don't make the mini map. The map will consistently be updated rather than information. Don't forget to check it once in a in a while. There must be someone in the house. Oh, that's a butt. It's not a mini map, but at least I can see where I've been, which is kind of cool. Let's try... Damn it. Yeah, let's go back to the library. Oh, wait, wait, wait. What's that on the refrigerator? Where we go? Oh, no. Oh, no. Why is this on the... Re Soul 7? Oh, why did I pick that up? Oh, God. Fastest way to the library. Oh, it's gonna be through the dining room. Let me know. All right. All right. Map. And a second door. This one here. Right. I want to at least grab the key first before I go off and go into that other room. Alright, can I... Uh, oil can. I'd like to use it. Perfect. All right. Perfect. It looks like old key. Okay, that's probably to the other side of the kitchen. Cool, cool. cool. Is there yeah. anything else on the drawer? Not sure. There's a folder. Uh, wonder what's inside. How about you open it? Haiku folder three. A piece of collectible reddish folder containing a bunch of papers. Q use. Uh, so I can't open it? Okay, alright. First comes the worst, I can try to burn them. Okay, let's go into that other room now. Oh, sweet Christmas. Who could be calling? Oh, uh, why, why, why would I pick up the phone? Hello? 
Who is this? Oh. Uh, I can't understand a thing. What is this? We can't leave my room. How the... What in the hell? Sounded like a child. Was that Husher's son? Their room. Good. So they're upstairs somewhere. So probably that's where everything's going to start going sideways. Um, I don't think that's the right hallway. I think that's going to... Uh, we're just going to leave me in the hallway. I want to go to the, the uh, dining room. So this way. Okay. At least I have a map. That's going to help me out so much. All right. Oh, cool, cool, but I have a key. Okay. Cool. I wonder if it's a uh, master key to everything. Ah, well, let's pick up this first. Mm -hmm. Screwdriver. It looks like it's seen better days, but that's fine. I'll take the screwdriver. Frick yeah. All right. Oh, God. Yeah, here it is. Let's see what we got. Huh. Oh god, a scribbled piece of paper from the smoking room of the finisher. Oh god, alright, here we go. Um, Julia, I saw another door yesterday. As I was walking by the dining room, I suddenly heard the music from Daddy's music box. When I went in, I saw the door. I went running to tell Mommy, but when we came back, the door was gone. She call scolded me for making things up. It's not fair. I was telling the truth, and there was an old door there, different from the rest. It even had a key in the keyhole. Mm. Uh, if I see it again, I'll go inside and leave the door open. That way, mommy will believe me. So, I saw a weird door. I saw the weird door Julia said. The one that wasn't there before. Oh, no, 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 no. I wasn't done reading that. Oh, my bad. Oh, let's see. No folder. Um, shit. Shit, shit, shit. Oh, boy. Oh, no. What is up with your s publishing emblem? Yeah, that's, that's good. Damn it. Oh no! What the? Good, there's a heartbeat coming from the wall. I'm so angry! Son of a bitch! Ugh! Alright, so I have these doors, they're seeing doors, a whole bunch of papers all over the table. Oh god. Huh? What? Um, what did you ha about? What did you ha about? God, why do you have just a lighter? Okay, whatever. Let's go in the other locked room before... Daniel? Is that you? Oh, good. Wait, hold... Mm. Fucking what? Oh, fuck! The door pushing and blocking. Yeah, they, yeah, so rapidly press. Once you feel strong enough to push the door back, press space. Okay, alright. Oh, Multiple times! Oh my god! What is going? Okay, all right. Luckily, you made it this time. You're safe for now, but they won't let your guard down. Whatever it was, could still be lurking in the shadows. Certain events will give you the chance to put your ear against the door. Uh, just remember to be extra careful. It might save your life. Frick. What, what just happened? Am I going crazy? Probably.
Oh my god. We avoid that room. We go this way. Okay. Alright. Let's head over to the kitchen. Whoa. Hold up. I'm not done down here. Thank you very much. Hold your horses. Oh, no. Oh, no. Why can't I hear inside of this room? I know it was right there. Oh, God. There's nothing here now. Can I listen to this door? Oh, God. I don't understand. Maybe it's only when... Uh... Okay. Not going to happen. Uh, Q use. There we go. Mm -hmm. There we go. Oh, no, no, no. Please, please listen. Please, for the love of God, listen. Alright. Cool. Cover just open. I'll keep that in mind just in case. Oh, tell me that's not a hiding place. Oh, for the love of God. Oh, damn it. I don't... I think it's been a while since you fed your birds. Oh, the wood! Okay. Hell yeah. Uh. With an axe? What do you mean? Do I have to cut it first? But there's an axe right there. Can I not take the axe? Come on! Alright, that's what that was. Looks like I can't interact with that lower one. Uh, nope. Oh well. Okay. Well, I have wood. I assume I could just go put it into the. Uh. I don't know if doing it right off the bat is good and what it'll stay, but um. At least go test it out. Um. Let's see. I believe it was this way. Can I go through the living room? Um. Dining room? Yeah, living room is over there. What is that? No, go away. Fuck off. Yeah, no, I gotta put the wood in there first. Alright. A little bit of wood. Q. Oh, fine. Instead of using my lighter, I'll use the matches. I don't think a few matches will be enough to light that. How about the lighter you have? Oh, you've got to be kidding me. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Alright. Let's try heading back into the... I have a couple places. No, but it would have lit up. Lit up. Excuse me. Um. Fuck. I think we're probably about as far as we can go, unless, unless that's end game stuff where we need to burn the uh, the music box. We will see though. Um. Yeah, I'm just going to assume that I saw everything. I've been through every room down here. Um, and just that's the front area. Yeah, all right. I think it's about time to walk upstairs now. I'm not happy about it. But I don't think there's much we can do. Left, the one to left downstairs anyways. No. Oh, come on now. Now upstairs. Oh, there's a big. Looks like someone took down a painting or a mirror. Uh, let's see. Is this the. No, it's not the painting. Oh, painting. Someone took it down. A label on the back says it's from February 1634. Uh, everything looks quiet out there. 
cool, 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 cool. Can I see rooms? No, just study. What do you mean, what? What do you mean, what? Alright, we'll just go in there. Nope. Can I use the key? Mm -hmm. Okay, cool. So it is a master key. I'll take a quick listen one more time. So I'm not dealing with this bullshit. Oh, fuck me. Why do you keep on giving me these cutscenes? What? It's totally dark in there. Can I turn on the light? Oh god, this is a terrible fucking idea. Nope. Look, I'm not going in there. I think I'm fucking dumb. Nope. You can wait. You can wait. I'm gonna go collect everything first. Okay. Let's see. An image of Catherine, Hush's wife, and their children, Julia and Sol. Oh, that's so weird. Do not look at this photo. Fuck me! God damn it! Can look at this too. I'm already fucked. Um, the first first novel I've read. Couldn't put the thing down. Yeah, that's good to know. Oh fuck me! All right, sounds sounds pretty open. Oh, you kid! You said you couldn't leave your bedroom. Listen, do you need a timeout? A dishcloth. I love, oh my god, that's so amazing. I do have to admit, playing Black Mirror and then jumping into this game and on top of uh, the shore, the graphics and just the, just everything is absolutely amazing. Uh, all right, so I'm going to, uh, just rinse the dirty cloth. Is there anything else in here? Toiletries, nothing else in here. Alright, well I can I can deal with at least just that. Kid, I think you need to time out. I need to stay in your bedroom. Oh hell nah. <laughs> Alright, I'm going this room. No, I'm jammed. Shit. Okay. Nope. I'm not even gonna bother. Photographs. Fuck me. Alright. Cool, cool, cool. What do you think? What do you think if I had some sort of lighter fluid and brushes and paint crayons? Well, I mean, why would anyone have works of art piled on the floor? They're antiques. Painted in March 1883 and September 1790. You think the dates will have to do with anything? I mean, there are flammable. Oh, wait, hold up. Hey, it looks like there's a ladder up there. There's a ladder? Can I get it? Looks like there's a ladder up there. So I need something. Uh, let's go get that. Alright, alright, alright. I want any one of them. Yeah, that's okay. So I need something to get up there, right? Yeah, okay. Oh, no. Okay. Alright, did this move yet, or is that going to be just a thing? Yeah, that's just going to be a thing. I'm not going to... I'm not going to walk this way. Alright, which way did the kid run? I think it was right. So let's go left. Oh, God, or did he run this way? Oh God, those paint, those those masks are just amazing. What is this? Remote control. Your standard garage door. Oh, that's cool. Yeah, right. I'll hold on to that. I probably have to go outside for that. What is this? Oh, an old armchair. Quality, quality armchair. Uh, if I were in danger, I could probably hide under that table. Why are there hiding places now? Reference books, manuals, um, encyclopedias. 
Uh, nice landscape. Oh, 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 hold up. I pushed the button. Now I'm walking to the desk. Come on, there we go. Nice landscape, although I wouldn't mind if it was a bit more color. Painted 1905. Listen, black and white is still the shit. Where have I seen this mask before? In a documentary about the South American tribes? African, excuse me. Uh, your classic index box for contact information. I got one in the office, but the wood is not as nice as this one. Hmm. Something broken in the keyhole. Oh my god, they keyed the door. Come on! Can I... Oh, wait, wait, wait. I have a screwdriver. Uh, Alright. Do I have anything else that could possibly do anything? Nah. Alright. Okay. Well, I do have a cloth. I Fuck me. I'm gonna go across the way, though. Follow the ghost child. I can go outside, too. Oh, this is a mistake. What do we got? Okay, just the one side. Perfect. Dear Sebastian, I wanted to tell you firsthand that I will be taking some much-needed time off. Which means that the store will be closed as of tomorrow. I wanted you to hear it from me rather than read it on the sign of our door. My daughter is currently traveling and, mu and I must confess I can't keep up with our everyday demands on my own. Especially since I haven't been able to sleep well lately. As soon as she's back, we will open up for business again. Rest assured, you will be the first to know. I hope you to feel better by then. Please give my warmest regards to your family. Sincerely, Isaac Ferber. Second letter from Isaac. A letter for Hersha. Yeah, yeah, okay. Easy enough. So he was not feeling well either for one reason or another. Okay. Well, for one reason. Oh, I should have listened to the... Oh. oh, I hate that. The camera view. It looks like someone's looking in on me. Scaffold goes here. Oh, are they added doing an elevate doing an add-on to the house? Erect scaffolding, paint exterior, repair leaks, fix, fix loose tiles, check all pipes. Oh, cool, 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 cool. So they're just fixing the house up. All right. Nothing of interest. I wonder if the scaffolding is already there. No. What? Mrs. Husher? This should be something that I should avoid. I need to get in there. Oh, you don't. Not gonna happen. It's closed on the other side. Okay. Well, good. Yeah, I tried. Oh no, there is a way over there. There's two doors. There's two doors that I really don't want to enter. I'm gonna start out here first. Oh, this is nice. Can't do anything with floodlight boy until I get power to it. Okay. Alright. Uh what if I connected the battery to that floodlight? Oh wait, hold up. Okay, so I need the wires downstairs. Some crates of fruit and a bag of something that resembles soil. Hmm. Okay, alright. Alright, perfect. Well, at the very least, uh, we got a decent ways into this. I know that things are going to start picking up extremely soon here, but I'm going to leave it here. I'll put this out uh, side by side along with the last episode of Black Mirror. Like, I, <sighs> I was hoping to put the shore. But after this, I'll probably end up playing the shore again and... <sighs> Man, I just just show you just how beautiful that game looked. Terrifying and beautiful all at the same time. Fantastic. And it's a relatively short game too, so that shouldn't be an issue either. But for now, I think we're set here before things start really heading south. So thank you once again for joining me under the yellow sign. And I hope you have a wonderful night.